YouTube world. This is your girl, Shawan Shani. Shawan Shani. Hey, y'all. I know it's been a minute, but some stuff came in my mail, and I ain't know what it was. I forgot. <coughs> That's why I did that. I forgot that I had um sent for it. So, you remember back in the days, we used to get those um, books. It's like Reader's Digest and this side of it. It'd be like the little tear off for like guide posts and you could like order something and they'll send it to you. I was like, oh, we did that in a long time. So I sent off for it and some stuff came. I think I remember doing about three of them, but only two came. So I'm just open the two that came, but I'm going to do them in two different videos. And then... I guess whenever the other one come, I do it in another video if that one. If that one come. But it's been a minute since I was on here. Yes, I'm in uniform. Oh, I'm eating Reese's at work. And my hair fits, so I wear this to work, especially when it's not fits. But you can see the bitty bees. I don't care. So, see the arm of my hair. I don't care. Period. I know I need this done. Internet. Whatever. But I don't know. I guess I'll open this one. It <laughs> it looks at a box of free gift inside. I probably showed y'all my little thing on the front, but I can't even take it off, so it's just gonna stay on there. Let me see what it is. And it says you can visit the website shopguideposts.org. I'll put the website down there too. Let me see. I don't know. <coughs> Just come from. All right. What is this? That's something my mama used. Oh, okay. It's a little bag. I gotta get my P.O. box back. It's a little, I guess a tote bag for books. Or for this book. Yeah. The Hidden Gate. It's supposed to be like a mystery book. And it's like about Savannah, Georgia. It's like some kind of history about a, a place down there. I think they were saying it's like a collection. I ain't read a book in so long because I've been working so much. But I'm going to read it. I'm going to put it on my bookshelf. And then I'm going to take it to work. It's supposed to be like a mystery. And I haven't read mysteries in a long time. I was trying to see. Oh, it just got what it's about back here. Meredith Bella Fontaine has recently opened her late husband investigation agency with her best friend, a retired juvenile court judge, Julia Foley, despite the anxiety that comes with starting a new business, leaving the comfort of her job as president of the Historical Society in Savannah and recovering from a new, a near fatal heart attack. Meredith truly believes that this is God's next step for her in life. Julia accidentally uncovers their first case. A rusty key finds in the dirt of an overgrown garden when the partners find the lock that fits the key. They also discovers items that are encountered with a 64-year-old unsolved case regarding the death of a young girl. As Meredith and Julia unearth clues and close in on a suspect, 
with someone's desperate attempt to keep this unsavory chapter of Savannah history buried, stand in their way, question mark. So, I guess that's what this is about. Welcome to Savannah, Georgia, picture-perfect southern city known for its manic Manicure parks, moss covered oaks, antebellum architecture. Walk down one of the cobblestone streets and you'll come upon Magnolia Investigation. It is here where two friends have joined forces to unravel some of Savannah's deepest secrets. Tag along as clues are exposed, red herring discarded, and thrilling surprises revealed. Find inspiration in the special bond between Meredith Belafonte and Julia Fowler. Share their French, cheer their. Cheer the friends on as they listen to their hearts and reply on the faith to solve each case that comes their way. Child, these people want to be CSI investigation, private eye. I ain't got the time to be uncovering stuff. I'm a case myself, shoot. I be looking for stuff to drink. They need to help me find a better solution besides water. And soda and juice and salt in between. So yeah, this is just a Aaron case for the ladies that probably be in book clubs. It's a pretty book though. It's cute. That's what the back look like. And as you can see, see how many chapters is it? They even got where you can sign up for a guy post fiction newsletter and stay up to date on the books you love. Down. They even got a recipe in the back that say Brunswick stew, Georgia style, chicken or pork. Oh, that's cute. It's 22 chapters. I like the way books smell. It's gonna rain outside. There'll be pain because it's about to rain. Trouble will come. Yes, it will. I don't need to put that back in there. I'm just gonna put it back inside this box. But um, ain't really too much I've been up to that what been going on, working. That about it. Trying to make this little hot forty dollars I got in Google Adsense make it to sixty so it can finally be released. Good lord, I've been on here for a little minute. These little videos ain't occurring. They ain't even moving. Maybe some of the people that um like these books and stuff, they might see that I got some books. They might watch this video and go and purchase it because I'm going to put in the description the link so they can read it. It looks like it's a, it's a good book club book. That's why I should title this book club. Yeah. I do like Guidepost Book Club. I just put their like in the tags we'll put like books for book club yeah that might be a catcher books for book club and put 22 because i'm pretty sure people's out looking for some books for their book club and i have a shelf full of books that can be used but that right there would be a, a good book to read it's not it's not deep it's not thick it's like it's fun and like somebody probably who's a reader, avid reader, 
try to knock that out in one day. Like, just read it straight through because it's 22 chapters. And it's not real thick. It's probably like maybe like 70 pages total. Besides the recipes in the back, it's probably like um, 240 pages total. The chapters are pretty short. Now some chapters be real long. I think this may be like um, a good um, one, two, three, four, four or five pages per chapter. So that'll be a good, easy, quick read. All right, you guys. On to the next.